No. Why? Why? Have you ever wondered how helium balloons or even bigger airfield ships stay in the air? Like the airship? You might have to think it has something to do with density. Well, you're right, but it's not simple as that. Uh, this is a balloon and it's filled with helium, making it less dense than the surrounding air. Hence, it rises. And this is a cat and it's filled with lots of stuff that is denser than the surrounding air. Hence, it does not rise. Let me introduce you to the force, the buoyant force, or what we call up thrust. Up thrust is the force responsible for pushing the balloon up into the sky. However, for us to understand up thrust, let us consider this. Imagine an ice cube underwater instead. We can all agree that the faces of the ice cube will be experiencing a force by the water pressure. Now, the force acting on top of the ice cube, pushing it down, compared to the force on the bottom of the ice cube, pushing it up, will be far less. Hence, resulting in a greater resultant force pushing it up. This is as the deeper you are under a liquid, the greater the pressure you experience. This force will be known as the up thrust. Rewriting the equations, we can get that the up thrust is equal to the weight of the displaced water by, in this case, the ice cube. Hence, if the weight of the object is heavier than the displaced liquid, there will be a resultant force downwards, thus the object will sink. Vice versa, if the weight of the object is lighter than the weight of the displaced liquid, there will be a resultant upwards, thus the object will float. To answer the question of how a blink flies, it's very simple. We can simply say that the object is actually lighter than the surrounding air as it is less dense. Hi, I'm Kailong and I'm the first scientist. Hi, I'm Chiu Hao and I'm the second speaker. Hi, I'm Frederick and I'm the third speaker. And hi, I'm Hendrico, I'm the cameraman and the editor of this movie. Thank you very much, thanks for watching. We are group... Group 20! 20! Yeah. Thank you very much, bye-bye!